Welcome back creator. So this is a very quick video. I'm just going to be showing you how I fix my quilling on my flay neatly and easily I would say. So the first thing is just to put your lining and your material right sides together like this. And after putting it on like this, the next thing you have to do is to pin everything down. Pin everywhere. Okay. So I'm going to be doing that shortly. So the next thing is to put your quilling on your lining like so and make sure that you have some crinoline left like you can see me right now pin the beginning of the crinoline so and the um, um, lining so that it will be firm at that beginning area crinoline is best for creating that wobbling effect on flay than gum stain because um, the crinoline can actually last longer and even if you wash it it does not break or fall yes it's time to add our hemming gum. I use this majorly. If you've been watching other videos, you see how I use this. So I'm just going to be putting the hemming gum like so, and I'm going to be showing you how I sew it. So I do not pin my quinoline or my hemming gum to my material or my lining. I just adjust them as you can see, and then I sew quarter of um three quarter of an inch. Okay, that's what I sew. It's not up to half of an inch. I use in sewing down my crinoline on my flay material it's that straightforward and easy now the next thing now is i'm just going to be showing you the results i went ahead to iron out my hemming gum and you see the bottom is really fitting and looking all nice and beautiful and all neat and you can see that the material did not puff out okay you're having some um like three quarter of an inch left there as you can see for a neat finishing so the lining and the material is not on the same length so so this is how our flay is looking um i'll be posting the full video of this dress so make sure you turn on your notification bell so that you get informed when the video of this dress is being posted so i just went ahead to arrange my flay like this looking like a pancake <laughs> a pancake flay if you enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing, liking the video, comment in areas that you are not understanding. So just a quick one. When you buy your crinoline and maybe it's looking very rough, do iron it. Okay, you can iron it first before you fix it directly on your flay. So people, till our next tutorial. Bye for now. Keep making progress.